Something else to cheers about? The new Grammy Museum Dave Matthews Band Exhibit. Doug Hulk is here with the deets. Here we go. That's us. Here we are again. Saratoga, New York, West Palm Beach, Florida, the Woodlands, Texas. It's like finding Waldo in a sea of 20,000. And that was just the last tour. This is the last stop. Overall, I'm looking at a number close to 80. A remedy. Some may call my love for the Dave Matthews Band excessive. What can I say? What would you say? In my opinion, they are the best at what they do. And one step inside the Grammy Museum, thanks to executive director Bob Santelli, you too can witness the power of DMB. We know how intricate that band is. Full of improv and layered. You really demonstrated that on paper. We've never seen it before in front of our eyes. Oh yeah, this is a complex musical, very sophisticated, live experience. The exhibit starts at the very beginning. So much the same, so much the same. Charlottesville, circa 1991. Cause the trip in between Dave, Boyd, Stefan, Leroy, and Carter, there's a little something on each member. In the beginning, the idea was to create an exhibit on Dave Matthews. And Dave set in, quite honestly, and he says, you know, it really is about the band. The exhibit portrays iconic performances. So I was at the Central Park concert in 2003, 110,000 other people there. Monumental shows. Giant Stadium, July 11th, 12th, and 13th of 2000. You know, I was at all three of those shows. I remember when they took that photo. And venues. My wife and I have been to the Gorge three separate occasions, and it's amazing. We rent an RV, we drive to the middle of Washington in a town called George Washington, where we camp out for three straight nights, walk to the amphitheater, and you're looking at the most gorgeous setting you could possibly imagine. For the casual fan, who may have heard about Dave Matthews, I'd like you to go through it with the idea that I am introducing you to a major artist that somehow you missed. For the hardcore fan, I'm hoping, keep my fingers crossed, that there's a few things in there that you didn't know about the band so that you walk away and say, it was worth my time. You know, I wonder if Doug knows Dave has been nominated for six MTV awards. 